Coach, big win, blank sheet. Just tell me how you're feeling after that. Yeah, feeling pretty good, you know. I mean, Santa Clara's an outstanding team. They're always top of the tables and so forth. So it was a good win for us, but just proud of the girls' effort because, you know, we talked about it before the game. You know, Pender's been talking to them about it throughout the course of the week. Um, we just we, – we put together a good 90 minutes, and it feels good. We're back at home. We played a complete game tonight, and we got some goals, got on top of them, and uh, I think it just encouraged us as the match went on. You didn't have too many shots, but it seemed like those goals came in bunches, three and four minutes. What did you see out of that sequence specifically? Yeah, I think in the first half, we, we talked about it at halftime. We just had to be a little bit more dangerous, you know, whipping some crosses, taking an opportunity to get a shot off in the second half. Um, we were much more dangerous. We had more possession in the second half, which created more chances for us. Uh, and, and we finished some good goals. I mean, uh, Alex's first goal, she ripped it, a good goal. And then Jackie, a little bit of magic down the, you know, down the middle of the park and, uh, and Ellie getting on the end of Alex's cross to get the third goal was, uh, was big for us and so forth. But it was a great team effort tonight. Defensively, uh, they had a few opportunities, couldn't put it home. What did you see out of that side of the ball? Sure. Bench? I mean, Santa Clara's good. They ranked 12th in the country, uh, you know, in the RPI this morning. Um, I thought our defense did a great job. I thought when Kenna Roth came on, she was big time tonight. Uh, but Kai was big time. Kier was very good in the goal. I mean, everybody just showed up tonight. And that's what we keep telling them that you need to do. You need to show up every night. You can't take a night off. You can't take 15 minutes off. Uh, we'll see them in a couple of weeks, and I'm sure over their place, they're going to be a tough out over there. So, uh, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll take the result tonight, obviously. It was a great win for us, but uh, I think at the end of the day, we still got work to do, and we still got, got to show up, and we're getting ready for conference. This match was kind of funky, conference opponent, non-conference game. How do you continue the momentum heading into WCC play? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's encouraging for us because, you know, we've been up and down in, in the non-conference. We've had some good results. Uh, we've give up, given up some bad goals. Um, and I think tonight was our most complete game we played throughout the course of the year. We wanted to score first, we did. Uh, we wanted to play hard for 90 minutes, we did. Um, so, and we wanted to have a little bit better possession in the second half, and we did. So I think uh, the kids know what it takes to get a result against an outstanding team like Santa Clara. Alex Carpio has come off the bench for a majority of the season, but when she gets the ball, she seems pretty dangerous. What have you seen out of her in the last couple of weeks? Yeah, she's she's... She's sharp. She had so much energy tonight, and she was so sharp in and around the box, beating players. Her work rate to get back defensively to help out in the midfield was 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 awesome as well. So Alex is uh, Alex can come out of nowhere and frickin' rip a ball, and she did that tonight. And what a goal! It reminded me of the cow goal last year she hit, um, but it was better tonight even.